Hi guys and welcome to another Windows tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to add a backup domain controller to a Windows Server 2008 R2 domain. So before we get started what you'll need is a server that is not actually on the domain but it's got a static IP address set up with the primary domain controller's information and that's really it, you don't need any roles installed or anything. Okay so good. To get started, what we need to do is open up the server manager. Click on roles. Click add roles. Okay, on this page, click next. Next click active directory domain services and DNS server oh sorry no you don't click that you just click next on this page click next and now click install okay now it's ready click Close this wizard and launch the Active Directory Domain Services Installation Wizard DC Promo. On this first page, click Next and click Next again. Here, click Existing Forest and add a domain controller to an existing domain and click Next. Now type in the domain that you want to add to the server to. In my example, HD Tutorials Tutorials dot net and give it alternate credentials. and click OK and click Next. It's found a domain, click Next, click Next again, leave these ticked and click Next, click Yes, leave these as they are and click Next. Type a directory services restore mode password This must contain one capital letter, one number, one symbol, and I think be more be longer than eight characters. So click next to continue. Click next again, and it will continue. It will finish off the install. okay and click finish when it's done and restart now okay now the computer is ready again log in as you'll see now it's got the domain there Okay, and now it's we're on desktop. You'll see that the computer name is changed to w2hd-dc-2.htutorials.net, and under roles we have 
Active Directory and DNS. So that's it for this tutorial, look out for more coming very soon.